Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Star Flames. In this video, we're going to talk about Sam the Snake, Asagari, and Britney Spears. Because if you're not aware, Sam and Britney is headed for a divorce. Now, it was yesterday that it was announced that Sam wants to divorce Britney Spears. After the report came about, many people were concerned as to why he wanted to divorce her. They were just rumors of cheating allegations on both sides. But what caught many people's attention was the fact that after the report came of Sam wanting to divorce Brittany, there, it was then reported that Sam is demanding that Sam the snake, that is, was demanding that terms and conditions of the prenup be honored or else he's going to release damaging information about Brittany. Now, as it relates to the terms and conditions of the prenup, right? Sam would receive $1 million for every two years that he stays with her. And that money was capped at, I believe it was either 10 or $15 million after 10 years, which means that no matter how long he stayed with her for, he would not be able to get over, I believe it's $10 million, right? Now, Sam and Brittany got married last year. So based on the time frame that they got married last year to the time that Sam announced that he wants a divorce from Brittany, it's been less than two years and as such, Sam is not entitled to a penny. So because Sam is not getting anything and that's Sam the snake, that is, he is threatening to blackmail her. But Brittany got up today and she was so unbothered that Brittany shared with her fans that she is going to buy herself a horse. And she was caught between two horses, but is leaning more to one than the other. Totally unbothered, right? We've seen this Britney Spears before. Because when she was getting divorced from her husband before Sam, that girl wore her wedding dress to the car dealer and bought herself a new car. So it seems as though Brittany is sending Sam a subliminal saying that, listen, I can get another ride in a minute. I've got more than enough money to do so. So to hell with you, boy. Brittany is giving, I didn't come this far just to come this far and not be happy. Brittany is still living her best life unbothered. So Sam seems to realize that Brittany is saying to him that, you know what, there's absolutely nothing damaging that you can release on me at this point based on everything that I've been through. So just go ahead and do what you need to. So here's what Sam is coming with. And this is why this man is just a darn fool, I believe, and keeps backtracking on his statement, right? So, Sam is alleging that he has reasons to believe Brittany cheated on him with a staff member at her house and also engaged in inappropriate sexual conduct as well, right? Sam claimed that Brittany asked at least one staffer to shoot a video of her naked. Not only that, um, Sam told reporters that um, he believes, believes, not know for sure, believes she hooked up with at least one of the male staff members working at her, at her home, right? So after Sam, the snake said that he believes that, he's not sure, he just believes that, right? They basically asked Sam, how do you know that? Why do you believe that? And he claims there is a footage of Brittany and the staffer together in compromising position. Now, we know that Brittany is not that type of person, right? 
So here how Sam is backtracking on his allegations against Britney. And I know that what Sam is also doing, he's using Britney's behavior that she plays on Instagram to say that she's hypersexual because Plies has been hyping up Britney too, you know, the um, artist Plies. He has been cheering Britney on, suggesting that she even gets a poll. So we've seen Britney getting that poll and she has been getting on on that poll, right? So in Sam's head, if he if he says that Britney is hypersexual and she's in a fragile and hypersexual state and it has contributed to her dangerous decision making, making her a risk to her safety and he believes that she should be in a conservatorship. Just imagine you have been this woman's husband, right? For over a year. And they have dated for quite a number of years. I think they met back in 2018, if I have the year correct. No, you should have been the one to ensure that this woman is protected, she's safe, and you're not, um, you know, manipulating her. But... You can tell that he was there just for money. He doesn't make this woman any well. Because the mere fact that even if you believe that she's not well, and because she's not well, she's in a hypersexual state, if you know that she's not well, why would you want to take disadvantage of her? It shows that Sam doesn't mean this woman any good either and he's saying that he has acted as a crutch for B for Britney for a long time and her recent conduct is just too much first things first you have been dating this woman for so long and you didn't vouch for her you haven't protected her even during your marriage people were able to just basically slap this woman down you were right there. You were not able to protect her, defend her, fight for her. And the one time that I saw Sam spoke out for Britney, when Kevin Federline clapped back, he was quick to delete that post like, he can't be bothered. He doesn't want to be bothered with fighting for her. So Sam has been giving opportunist vibes. And many TikTokers have been exposing Sam and some of the things that he has done, and also his lack of affection towards his wife. So Sam has definitely always been given snake vibe, and Sam keeps backtracking on his words, because this minute, he has reasons to believe that she cheated. The next minute, there's a footage of her with a staffer in a you know, compromising position. And then she asks the staffer to take videos, to video her naked. The reality is Brittany is an adult. While I understand she's married, if she wants to ask a staffer to take a video of her nude, it doesn't mean that she's involved with that person. It could be something that she wanted to do for herself. And if Sam was acting like a husband to Brittany, she would not have any need to turn to a staffer. Brittany has never been that type of girl. So what Sam is trying to um, make things seems as though because Brittany is mentally ill, she's just on inch and she's hypersexual, just making risky decision, going around sleeping with random people. And Brittany is not conscious of her decision because she's not well and she needs to be in a conservatorship. So Sam is joining the, the conservatorship gang because he knows that they have all manipulated Brittany and they all have one common ground and that is getting Brittany's money. So it proves that this Sam the snake really didn't care about Brittany nor her affairs and his reason are just all over the place and no real man who cares about a woman threatens to 
blackmail her if he doesn't get money. Definitely proving that Sam is a sneak. Definitely did not have Britney's affair at heart. And that's all I have to say about Sam the sneak who pretends as though he's not able to work. I think Sam is the one with the disability. Sam is the one who needs to be in a conservatorship because he's giving weak and he's giving gold digger energy. But I want to hear from you guys. Let me know what are your thoughts about Sam saying that Brittany is not well and needs to be in a conservatorship. I want to hear from you guys. And while you're at it, give this video a big thumbs up. Share if you care and see you all later. Bye guys.